The complexities of this are that, of course, Saudi Arabia and other Sunni states uh, on the Gulf there will be very happy if Israel does do that. Yes, absolutely they would. And, and it's, it's worth um, thinking back a year uh, to remember that one of the reasons why Hamas, uh, it's thought, um, staged that horrible attack into Israel 12 months ago was because Israel and Saudi Arabia were probably a week or two away from signing a peace agreement. Uh, and, of course, that suits no-one's interests uh, in, in Iran. It suits none of the extremist terrorist organisations that Iran funds and trains. But, frankly, most of the... Um, certainly the Sunni Arab countries, that, that is to say um, uh, Saudi Arabia, Israel... Uh, sorry, Egypt and Jordan, uh, many of the Gulf states, you know, th they would rather see Israel... Um, damage Iran's nuclear weapons ambitions. Absolutely. And see Iran emerge as the nuclear power in the Middle East. Absolutely. No doubt about that whatsoever. Just briefly, uh, before I let you go, Peter, uh, we're still waiting for this action. What would be taking the time now? Would it be Israel fine-tuning the exact uh, nature and targets for its response, or would it be them uh, negotiating behind the scenes to make sure that the US is satisfied with whatever their response is? Probably more the second. I think they'll have the target set down pat by now. Uh, what was very interesting was to see the Americans sending in a very capable anti-missile uh, weapon, uh, the THAAD, along with 100 American troops. Some might say that's America's attempts to stop Israel from attacking Iran. On the other hand, you could see it as a way of giving Israel more confidence that they can attack Iran and be protected at the same time. So I don't think we can be very far away from a military strike unless the Americans can find some way to get Tehran to back down, and at least as of today, that doesn't seem very likely. It raises the stakes, too, for US troops to be there uh, on the ground uh, in, in the light of any uh, further Absolutely. Iranian attacks. Yeah. Thanks so much for joining us, Peter. I appreciate it. Peter Jennings there from uh, Strategic Analysis Australia. Uh, the whole world waits to see what next unfolds.